Welcome back, everyone, to another episode of Cretan Chaos. I want to thank everyone so much for joining this, and if, if joining us, I can't talk at all. If you enjoyed, or if you are enjoying this series, please feel free to leave a like, subscribe, and join the Discord server. We're also going to make sure that we move our cohorts properly because, yeah, because of that. We're also going to build another road. We're going to make sure we that we are able to travel well. We're going to build some more rows over here. We're not quite ready to declare war yet. We are going to make sure that we transport our troops properly. Uh, we're going to build some roads. But taxation is theft and roads are theft. <laughs> uh, yeah, we got to do this stuff first. Um, I also would like to recruit to this army. Call to arms. Why? Dude, why? Who are you at war with now? Uh, fine. Look. Fine. Call me into the war. I'm doing nothing. Alright? I'm not going to do anything. I'm only... I only want to keep... I don't... Look. I only want your cohorts. Alright? I'm just going to be totally honest with you. You have 57 cohorts. I have 50. I'm about to have 60. Alright. Let's recruit to this... Uh, <clears throat> yeah, now we can record, recruit uh, heavy and light cavalry. Let's build two heavy cavalry and three heavy infantry. And for this one, how are these built up? Uh, 393. Three. That seems about right. Okay. I need a place where I can build heavy infantry, but <clears throat> other than that, Oh, well, I could import iron here. Uh, no, I can't. I cannot do it. From latium. Of course latium gets iron. Of course they do. Can we import stone? Alright, well, stone will help here. This is borderlands for, uh... For memes. No, I'm just kidding. Stop. I tell myself to stop all the time. Oh, we can't import precious metals anymore. <clears throat> How can I see the actual province loyalty? Can I... Oh, is that this? Aha! Okay, province loyalty. I did not see that. All right, but it's still going up. Going a little bit down by Curicum. Curicum? This... Where is that city? Is that this? Curicum. And why? Military reforms, I know. Unhappy pops. I mean, the slaves are happy. Why are they so happy? Local autonomy, olives. Oh, the base happiness is 100. And the local autonomy is just boosting them right back up to 100, so. Yeah, let's just, uh, slave happiness, we don't need that. Citizen happiness, yeah. Now, we're, we're making a little bit less money now, but I think it's okay. We need to get, uh, we need to get iron, though. We don't really have a surplus of iron, do we? Yeah, we do have iron that's produced here. And I'm so glad that iron is produced in Crete. Dude, that is so cool and so convenient. But... Let's see, following bonus... This would lower our access to fish, makes us lose the population growth. We'll put up with it. We have a surplus of glass. And we all, yeah, we trade. That's because we trade. It's a traded surplus, not a produced surplus. Okay. What about the actual statistics of the province of Crete? It actually, <clears throat> it actually is somewhat, um, what's it called? It's actually somewhat even. It's just that almost all the slaves are in Gnosis. They're, they, they almost all work in the capital. That's where they're working. I'm working in the capital. That's a little corrupt. That's oh, not too bad. Sacrifice to the gods cost. 
Yeah, we don't need, we don't even need to sacrifice to the gods because it seems like our guy is never gonna die. He's still at 100% health. Dude, catch dementia or something. He's stressed out. Yeah, that didn't have an effect at all. That did not have an effect at all on his thing because he has a base of zero. So effectively he has negative three finesse. He has negative one uh, Marshall. Dude, he sucks. He's, oh, thank goodness I've got cancer. <laughs> thank goodness. All right, now in a minimum of 100 months. Oh, now a little bit, a little bit more than 100 months. It might take like 102 months. All right, what kind of policy do we got right now? Local autonomy. If I pay 50 oratory power, I could change it. I also would get some tyranny, but that's fine with me. Borderlands would give me more fort defense. That would be good. I need that. I know I gain a little bit of tyranny, but I can't help it. We also want to make sure that we've got a lot of fortresses in Pella, which is good. We do. All right, we're going to fabricate a claim. I think we're about ready. What? No. Okay, fabricate a claim. We can actually, like, gain some of their stuff right there. Um... Okay, here in Thessaly, is that what we want? Let's get the one in Thessaly. Or we could get. We could get uh, Macedonia. We're gonna do that one. I think it would be easier to capture. We're right next to it, and we've got this level 3 fort in, in uh, Pella. That's gonna be very hard for them to capture, and it'll instantly start capturing a bunch of cities around it, so. I think I'll be able to do this. Pioni as their subject. They're a tribal vassal. Macedon protects Pioni. Pioni is limited by Macedon. Oh. Oh. So Pioni is not actually required to come to their aid. They might not actually join. Okay, what do we have here? Public slavery, waste disposal, commerce income, sacrifice to God's cost, diplomatic range. <sighs> Do we wait for the next marshal, which is more... S oh, whoa. Hold on. Heavy cavalry discipline. I'm going to wait. I'm just going to wait. Autosave. Come on. Like, give, me, give me the normal map. What is, what is going on here? Yeah, give me the normal map. <laughs> okay. Uh, we've got roads going on, but... We need more. We need more roads! Okay. Oh, guys, I'm getting a little nervous. They have 52 cohorts, and we can't, we can't really get heavy infantry here, can we? I wonder if Rome has roads. Yes, they do. They actually do. They're building roads. That's cool how the road, like, disappears behind a building. Does Carthage have roads? It doesn't look like it. It really doesn't look like they have roads. Allows the failing ability can unlock the cavalry skirmish, can unlock military colonies. I still don't even know how to do military colonies. Raid city ability. How do I do raid silos? That's cavalry skirmish. Okay. Where's the raid city? Oh, raids, raid ports. That might be the same thing. Can I see like... I, I don't actually know how to use that. Okay, that's fine. That's fine, that's fine. Simple political. I like the political map mode. The terrain map mode is okay. Stop, I wanna click somewhere else. The terrain map mode is okay. It's a little washed out, which I'm okay with. The political map mode is actually more washed out. Um, 
it's a little desaturated but when you scroll uh it, when you when you zoom in it does not change it if you go to the terrain map mode you can actually see the terrain which is very minimum political things Which is okay if you've got a country like Rome, and you can see, okay, these are my borders right here. But when you've got territory in so many different places, it's like, see this, it gets a little confusing. So I prefer the political here. Cool. Got that. I'm going to leave the roads at that. And what were we actually waiting on? We have the claim. We're gonna call Odrissia in. And we can get... We can get the this thing, but it's in two years, so I'm just gonna wait. Declare war, take Macedonia, call our ally. <sighs> okay, here we go. Seleucid Empire will become the war leader. I understand. Oh, these guys are like almost all. Oh my gosh. Hold on. These are all loyal to some other guy. Like, there's some. There are some that are loyal to just him, but I don't know. Anyway. There's gonna be a battle there. There's going to be a battle there. What's wrong with them? What's going on? It's weird. All right, let's keep our army sort of together. Can't do much here. Oh, Lemusa. Where's Lemusa? Dude, that's Lemusa. Except in call to arms. Duh. They've got 39 cohorts. Yes, please. Lend me your army. Okay, we're doing fine. We're gonna do fine, I think. And wasn't I importing hemp from somewhere? This is part of Greece. This is part of Greece. I really, I really do need to get more actual cities in Greece. This would be really nice to connect my territory. And then this too. Yeah, these two right here would be great. And then adding on to these two would be crazy good. I don't know how possible that's going to be, but okay, hold on. We've got Defender controls the province of Macedonia. Oh, okay, we need uh, to control these two two other cities here. Okay, that's not a problem. Totally not a problem. Oh, uh, they want to import stuff. Yeah. Give it to them. Do it to it. Alright, let's also capture another thing. Uh, probably would be good if we could build a fort here. Alright, sorry. Siege the fort there. <laughs> want to siege it. How's his loyalty doing? He's fine. Yeah, he's fine. How's his loyalty doing? He's also fine. How's his loyalty doing? He's also fine. Okay, so we have... We've got, like... Really loyal generals. As far as that goes. Okay. Dude, another one of my Let's Plays is going to be a tribe. I bet. I bet you it's going to be this tribe right here that, that starts with these three cities. Maybe they start with four? I don't know. They might just start with these three. I But I would like to do that. And I think, I think one of the things that I've noticed about this game is that... Um, there you go. Is that uh, it's, it's sort of like CK2 in the respect that it's sort of easier to play as a small country than it is to play as a large country, at the beginning at least, because um because 
it's sort of easier to play as a small country, and the reason why is that, like, when you start out, you've got very few things to manage. You don't have a lot of characters to manage. Um, you don't have, like, all these governors that you have to keep track of and manage their loyalty and everything like that. Uh, you don't have to manage a whole bunch of trade routes and everything, and you sort of, like, ease into it. Whereas if you start as a huge country like Egypt, then that might be a problem because you start out with, like, thousands of pops to manage. That's the other thing, is that, like, when you first start... Oh, this... Hold on, this is bad. Is there gonna be a battle here? Edessa. Why does it not... Oh, this is a different city. If I... Now, if I start to move, it says it's unclear because they have a higher... Marshal. They have cavalry. It's light cavalry. Oh, light... Oh, that's light infantry. Light cavalry, heavy infantry doesn't do too well against. I'll leave it. But I can't get out of here. That's what that means. But I can go over here, and I probably will. Our side might win. They don't have any benefits. They're not stronger. They, We got equal tactics. Oh, this is bad. That could be bad. But this is fine. Oh, crap. Our triremes are battling. How about we retreat, please? Please? I really don't want to lose. I really don't want to lose all my ships. But I've got to, like... Independent operations. Why don't I go with independent operations? Yeah, that's not going to work out. Yeah, he's going up to port. That's what he's doing. And we won this battle here. Good. Okay, now I would like to siege some stuff, but... Hold on, what territory is this? This is actually farmlands. I could take this army up here, and then I would outnumber him. Yeah, I think that'll be fine. Yeah, he took Edessa, and now he's... Okay. That means that I no longer control the war goal. We're defeated and we captured. So they captured some guy. So now he's in Pella. Oh, oh crap, crap, crap! Don't, don't do that. <laughs> he doesn't want me to go into Edessa. He really doesn't. Oh, he moved out of Pella anyway. What if I do this, and then I go with Force March here? 6th of October. Still 6th of October, but then I'll apply... How long will it take me to get there? Doesn't actually say how long it'll take. Unit Visible. This is fine. I'll... Well, Phalanx would help out our light infantry, but I think the bottleneck's fine. Um... Well... This would arrive on the 5th of October. Oh, this... That might not be a good idea. I'll force march there, but... He's gonna leave... I might catch him, but I don't want to catch him, though. You know what? Let's just go. Let's let's do it. 18th of October, but we're going to begin the battle on the 14th of October. Oh, he escaped. Okay, then we're fine. And also, we do control Pella, so... Oh, we're defeated. Hold on, where? Where, where, where? Crap! I wasn't paying attention to these guys. Okay, so that means we need to head over here. And with one of these guys, we need to send them down here. Oh, crap, we're gonna meet, aren't we? Alright. Alright, okay. Let's wait for him to get locked in. We'll force march. Alright, he's gonna arrive on the 16th of November. Force march. 15th of November, so he's gonna be fighting us. And we're the defenders. Yeah, we're gonna win. He's No, yeah, yeah, he can't win against us. 
We've got a ton more discipline than he does. We have a lot more heavy infantry. We just outnumber him by a lot. We also have... Uh, we don't have any heavy cavalry. I don't know where our heavy cavalry is. It's there, actually. Okay. Uh, these guys can go down there. Okay. Researcher needed. Marshall advances. Let's get a good guy. Oh, we're fighting there, too. Hold on. Uh, force march. I've still got force march on. I should turn that off after this battle. 30th of December. Oh, come on. Hold out. You can hold out. Boom! Yes! All right. We made it. We did it. Okay, we'll definitely win this. Yeah, we won. And we're doing fine on manpower. We're, we're gonna lose a little bit, but we have over 100,000, so I think we're doing all right. All right, let's turn off Force March, shall we? M. Does anybody else have Force March? These guys. Okay, we're gonna need to capture a fort, shouldn't we? Oh, we're fighting Iolia as well. We need to really capture a fort. Which is here, I believe. Yeah, it's here. For the state, our covers are looking bare. Ooh, Ka Calipolis? Where is that? This province gets a market... So this city gets a marketplace. No, let's... Let's just gain money. Even though we... We have plenty. We have plenty of money. Let's look at the trade overview. We actually... No, that's not what we need. Crap, how can you... I think it's the nation overview where you can see the trade routes. Yeah, there you go. Calabria. They need a trade thing. You get horses, wood, grain. Good to grain. Spices, commerce income. Yeah, let's do spice. Okay, anyone else that doesn't have a trade route? Chalkadiki? Chalkadiki. Do we can we get stone? You cannot imp you cannot import to other countries' cities. You need to select your own city. What? Boom. Yeah, it's fine. So if we get the stone surplus, we would get more local fort defense. And plus money. I mean, who doesn't like money? All right. Illyria, Grykia, that's fine. Laconia, we need a trade route there. Can we import stone here? Yes, we can. It's costing us a bit of civic power, but I think that's all right. Uh, Liburnia, no. Seculia, no. Thessaly. Oh, that's right. That's right. We do control a single city here in Thessaly. That's kind of cool. We could actually do a trade route based on that, but... I think we're all right. I think we're just fine. Okay. So we need to... We really need to take this fort. Are they trying to attack? Not yet. I highly suspect they will begin to attack, though. If we give them a chance, we need to move closer. Oh crap, no, this this is the right, we're, we're in the right place. Okay, our ally is helping out over there. We need to go over here. And here. We control the war goal, we have seven war score. And I bet you with Makadon we have more. More war score. We won the siege. Oh, sweet. Good. All right, so what that means is that we should get... We should start transferring control of these nearby provinces. Cities. And also, hold on, I need to change something always on. Yeah, I wanted the city names always on. Um, 
Isn't that gonna like transfer occupation or something? Are they in the zone of? Oh, here we go. Yeah, it's 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 transferring occupation. It's an occupational hazard. All right, we could go over here. They would they would slightly outnumber us, but they've got ten heavy infantry. We've got we would have a lot more because we go very light on the light infantry and cavalry because they're sport they're supposed to. Like, in our army, they're just meant to, like, back up our heavy infantry rather than being a core part. Whereas in, in their army, the light infantry are, you know, almost equal with the heavy infantry. So, I think we can probably do that. I keep forgetting it on pause. I'm sorry, guys. Alright, let's attack. And apparently he's going to escape. Oh no, it's very likely our side will win. They have a stronger army, but we've got better quality in all respects. Like, much better discipline. The terrain is not to their advantage. They've got higher numbers, though. That is the one thing they have on us, and I'm a little bit scared of it, but... Currently, we have a lot more morale. They also have more heavy infantry at this point. I'm kind of scared of this right now. They're they're at 1.9. Hold on, did they gain some? Why are we at 0.8? 2.10. What? Only the cohorts of the front line are considered. But these guys are just dying because they're just being attacked right here. They're not on the front line. They're reorganizing. Oh my gosh, how long can this freaking battle go on? I don't even know if this battle can continue to go on. Like, it might... But I feel like I'm gonna win! Look at this right here! They have a single thing in the front. The rest of them are out of morale. Yeah, we won! Okay. Their commander lost popularity. Our po our commander got popularity. He's very he's very popular. Oh no, he's not very popular. <laughs> that was a crazy battle, dude. That was a very crazy battle. They're on the retreat now, but I'm gonna send over a full strength army now. We've got 18 war score. They won't even accept white peace. But when we do that. Hold on. Master any threat? Hold on. What? Suggest. They would give me these two provinces. Why would they not? They won't take white peace, but they'll take me demanding two provinces from them. And probably just because it's the war goal. Yeah, war goal plus 20. That's why. Right? Like, if I if I was demanding something else, they probably wouldn't do it. Okay, let's spread them out just a little bit. I don't want to... I don't want to get crazy with spreading them out. I got to be careful with it. But... And also, we want the Blessing of Ares again. Oh, yes, we're about to get the next Martial Advance. Fighting Season, Centuria. Fortified Camps. We're going to get the uh, Army... Ooh, the Army Movement Speed would be really good. I think I'm going to get that first. But we can almost afford two, so... Okay. Boom. Okay, let's get the quick march first. Alright, now we can actually get the Scythian saddles as well. Boom. Because that was fast. Alright, and well, can we can also get a military tradition. Alright, experience decay. Yes, experience decay minus 50%, cohort starting experience, good. 
We're gonna go down this path. It's gonna take a while, but... Okay, now these guys are pretty much at full strength. Uh, they need to... Well, we need to actually fight them because they've got an army there. Anyways, guys, I want to thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please have a like, subscribe, and join the Discord server. Also, thank you so much to Shem for being my Patreon supporter. If you'd like to support me on Patreon, then feel free to click the link down in the description below. That being said, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time.